Hello and welcome to the Fibonacci free video for Monday, December 12th. This is David and I'm looking at XLK, the, um, the technology uh, ETF, right? Um, the most heavily weighted sector in the S&P 500. And so what we see here may be very consequential to what we see uh, in the markets. And we've been watching this because in the decline from the um, from the August high to the October low, um, here the week before last, we rallied back up right into the 61.8% retrace of that prior decline. That's this magenta line. And of course, we've got the voodoo fire line right above it. Um, right, the, the coincidence, the clustering of those two levels told us the import. And we did come off for about a week and a half from those levels. Um, slightly uh, to slightly below the 130.42 voodoo snow line and then we've recovered it. So um, look, the snow line would be a reasonable place to, um, to bounce in moving away from that voodoo fire line. Um, and of course the 61.8% retracement. <clears throat> and as we look at that, right, and try and guess what's going to happen, you know, we can monitor these smaller degree uh, voodoo lines between uh, the two, the voodoo skylines that come in, or we can just watch this bounce and see if it turns back down, cracks the 132 or 130 and 42 cent snow line or recovers to um, the fire line. But another way to watch this is just to come in and dig into the shorter time frames in the middle. Um, Right and um, and then note that what we've recovered to is pretty much at today's high the 161 or sorry the 61.8 percent retrace of the decline from that de <laughs> um, December 1st high and so now the question is, I think is you know do we revert below this um, and find resistance at the 61.8 percent retrace. Um, Right? Uh, or do we climb above it? Now, is it possible to go a little bit above and then come down? Yeah, but we've got consequential uh, news tomorrow in the form of CPI. So I'm thinking um, we get a decision in this area as to whether we're heading back up, testing that fire line and the, the larger, longer time frame, 61.8% retrace on the daily, or we're heading back down um, and uh, then we can look at external retracements of this bounce for how, <coughs> how far uh, that might go. So that's what I'm looking at uh, short term in what I think is an important and consequential ETF. Uh, we'll see what happens here on, uh, on CPI tomorrow and I will see you at the next update. Hey, David here with Simpler Trading. Thanks for taking a few minutes to watch this video. I hope you found it useful. And if you did, please help us out. Click the like button. You can also add your comments below. We love to read those and respond to them. You can also click the bell icon. That will alert you whenever we have new and updated videos. And if you want to watch us trade in real time with our own money, you can visit simplertrading.com to learn how to sign up. Until I see you again, as always, good trading, and we'll see you at the next video.